Wow, look how many perk bars I have. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. Look, I have 16 bottles in 18 seconds. Hello YouTube, my name is Grandpa Fan, and welcome back for another video. Today's video, I'll be showing you how to make all 16 zombie perk bottles plus three deleted ones, which is, gives us a total of 16 perk bottles. But anyway, if you follow these steps, but anyway, let's get right into the video, a how-to video. Probably got to say yourselves, what, Grandpa Fan, or, or at GPBTV, you guys, you already made a how-to video about how to make zombie perk bottles, but I haven't made it for all 16 yet. But if you ever checked out my how-to video about how making how to make zombie perk bottles, there'll be a link down in the description. Check the video out, and then you, you could check out the video again for this one. All right, let's start the beginning. But anyway, before we start, we'll go from left all the way to right. But how I um for the zombie perk bottles, what I used was Goya bottles, and I got these at Walmart. But you could get you could use any type of soda bottles, soda perk bottles, whatever it is. You can either use Jones or these. Goya bottles, they were at my place, they were around 80 cents, worth it. Which, yeah, let's begin it. And how I did this, I used red food, uh, in this video you'll probably need food, food coloring and labor paper, which I have it like here. There'll be a link down in the description for all the perk labels or, and the deleted ones with the neck labels, everything like that. I'll keep, t I'll stop talking about the link down in the description. It's probably getting annoying, but. What I did for this, uh, what I did for Juggernaut, how I made it, I made, I did like th around three squirts or four. Probably like, you can either do like, see like five or six squirts in which you can get like a dark red. But if you want like the perfect red, you can either use like those Gatorade fruit punch bottles or like fruit punches. Which that's how I made Juggernaut. On to the next one, the original double tap. How I made this was... Red and orange, a red, why, why I said red and orange, red and yellow, because don't roast me in the comments down below, but I did was red and yellow, and I just kept stirring it, and then afterwards, I probably did, like, see, two reds and two yellows, that's how I made this orange, this is a bright orange yellow, or a bright orange, not bright orange yellow, but it's a bright orange, on to the next one, how I made green was, I just had, um, a green food coloring, and that's how I made green, that I probably used around four or f I, this is a light um probably I used was like two or three squirts and then I poured some out uh poured some water out and then added more water and just stir it up and that's how I made sleight of hand. On to the next one, quick revive. How I made quick revive was one squirt of blue and just poured some water out and add more water in and just keep stirring it. And that's eventually you get to a light blue color like that. That's how I make quick revive. On to stamina up. Just have to focus it in. What I use for stamina up, um, the how I made it was lemonade, cause um, or pineapple juice, cause the soda that I got from Goya, they were from pineapple. Uh, it was pineapple juice, which I used pineapple juice from that. Which that's stamina up for you. That's bright. It should be bright yellow. Yeah. I just, I'll be right back. I just have to turn my clamp light on because you guys are probably gonna complain. Why is it so dark in here? I have bad lighting, but I'll be it's right back. It's probably much more brighter now since I have the clamp light right behind me. It's a little more brighter. On to PH, PH, oh, why am I saying, P, oh yeah, PhD flopper. Okay, I was about to mess up. What I used for PhD flopper was raspberry uh, fruit punch or fr raspberry juice, or you can use grape juice, some type of purple color. Cause how I made, you're yeah, eventually gonna see Tombstone, which Tombstone, what I actually originally did for Tombstone, which is like a purplish color, was three squirts of red and two squirts of blue, and eventually it's gonna be like two, uh, like um, a purple color, but for PhD Flopper, I highly recommend using grape juice or raspberry juice. On to Mew Cake, what I did, I actually didn't even do anything, all I did was get a green bottle, cause they had a green bottle for Goya, and just add water from there, which... That's meal cook for you. On to the next one for dead shot daiquiri. Dead shot daiquiri. What I used was oh yeah, dead shot daiquiri. I used some soy sauce. So soy sauce. There we go. I can't say it right. Soy sauce. Uh, of which I I used soy sauce from there and then add a little bit of water. 
And which that is that shot Thackeray for you. On to the next one for Tombstone, but I'll just repeat it again for Tombstone. What I did for Tombstone, I used three skirts of red, of three red, uh, three red co of food coloring, and two blue, and just mixed it up from there. And then it gives you like a, a dark, dark purple. That is Tombstone for you. On to the next one for the two, Double Tap 2.0. What I did for Double Tap 2.0, I made it like a dark orange. Which I did was, I think I did was two red and one yellow. I, I stirred it up and it became like that. Or well, if not, one red and one yellow. And then stirred it up and it'll be like a, a dark orange. That's Double Tap 2.0 in Black Ops 2. But on to the next one for Electric Cherry. Electric Cherry, what I did for Electric Cherry, I did was, uh, I made it like a, probably like two or three squirts of red, cause, f compared from Juggernaut, Juggernaut's a dark red, and Electric Cherry, I made it like, actually like a cherry, like a bright red. In which, this is a lighter red, you can see on camera, but that's Electric Cherry for you. On to Who's Who, what I did for Who's Who, was one squirt of blue, and I just dump some water out and add one water in, um, which I only did only once when I added water in, in which that's who's who for you. On to the next one for Vulture Aid. Vulture Aid, what I did for Vulture Aid was one red and one one yellow, in which that gave me an orange. You can probably tell uh, on to the next one, but I made it like a dark orange. One red and one yellow, and that's how I got Vulture Aid. You guys are probably gonna say to yourself, what is Tough Brew and Candelier and Amormatic? Originally from Call of Duty World at War from Doris, they originally they were gonna add in these three perks, which can Tough Brew, which originally was supposed to be, was stopping power for like uh, zombies apparently. And Candelier was supposed to be like Bandelier. For zombies, which gave you more ammo for your guns, and animatic. What I did, uh, what animatic was when you, it's similar to, like it's similar to scavenger. When you kill an enemy, you gain ammo back. How I made tough brew was one red, one yellow. No, it was two, two red, two yellow, which gave me a uh, bright enough orange. On to candelier. What I did for candelier was. What was it? One green. I think it was one. One green. And I poured some water out, which gave me a light green. That's candlelight for you. Lastly, on animatic, what I did for animatic was one blue and poured some water out until I get like a light blue. Which I poured some water out and added water in was around three or four times and I stirred it up. And that concludes all my perk bottles. Small overview. From left to uh, right to left and left to right. Yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this whole video. If so, if you learned something new. Or if I actually helped you in making how to make all these six, all 16 perk bottles. Hit the like button down below. Subscribe to me if you haven't subscribed to me yet. And join the Penguin Nation Army. We're still growing very strong. As always, my name is Grant Pameron. I'll see you in the next video. We need to get more subscribers in so they can meet the Penguin Nation Army. We're still going very strong. As always, my name is Grant Penguin. I'll see you next video in the next how-to video. Peace and love.